Hi, I'm Mohammed Jamal. Conservationist Jane Goodwill once said, children can change the world. Without realizing, without realizing it, we applied ourselves to that goal back at school. We even changed a few things in our little corner of the world. Let me tell you about it. In Penguin Court, we have weekly meetings on Wednesdays. After school, at these meetings, we select a leader to be the master of our ceremonies and get things going. We always start the same way. The weekly leaders will ask the other kids, what are we trying to do? The kids respond, change the world. Then the leaders ask, how do you change the world? The kids reply, be crazy enough to think you can. This gets things started on a positive note. And the kids are excited about whatever it is we're doing that night. Lesson started for us with learning how to install software. This just this isn't just the apps, but also the operating system itself. And doing it in Linux is very different from doing it in Windows. Most of these computers we have been working on were about to be sent to the recycler. But with Linux, we we can put them back in use. But with week. Oops. They are currently in the social studies classroom at our school. Most of the people today think installing software means simply clicking a button that says install. But, but with that is a whole lot of fun putting it in a terminal window and typing the commands for the computer. In fact, all members of the Penguin Core learned how to do this. We never made it a requirement because everyone wants to do it anyway. I enjoyed it too. Most of our members are also in technology class where they are learning about digital citizenship. When we come to club meetings, it's expected that we operate under the same digital values we have been taught. In fact, we're expected to model it for other students. This includes not using the machines for bad things, like hacking into other kids' accounts. As I mentioned, we refurbish computers. We work on old computers that either the school didn't want anymore or that people have donated to us. They don't just stay at school, however. So far this year, we have given away two computers that family needed. This is helping to close our school digital divide. You know what they say about all work and no play. We ended our fall season at Penguin Corps by having a game night. Kids got to have fun installing and playing open source video games. So what's next? When the second semester starts, our members are going to write stuff about games for her website. So. Some of the kids are say they're ready for a YouTube channel. I know I am. The biggest job will be having our current member teach our new members. I believe we're up for the challenge. What impact do we have for starters? Our social studies class teachers don't need to check out the computer cards because they have computers in the room. Computers nobody else wanted. From September until now, our Linux user base has gone to zero. Over 150, 150 students. So what's computer from? So our children are learning tech skills that will not learn anywhere else, at least not yet. And let's not forget, when more of our students go home, they have a computer to use. Thank you. And how you say in Somali is, Wamasa Now, Chase Walgrave will persuade.